Hi, my name is Mike Shaw, responsible for cooking products here at Morphe Richards. And today we're going to be creating a delicious butternut squash, chilli and coconut soup using our saute and soup soup maker. So this is the product I have in front of me. First off, what we're going to do is saute our butternut squash in the main cooking jug. So to do that, we press the saute button on the side of the handle. As you can see, the button on the handle is now turned to green. So the heating element in the base of the product is just starting to warm up. So to that, we'll just add some oil. We'll give that a minute to warm up. So our oil is now heated up inside the jug. So we're just going to add our butternut squash and saute this for a few minutes. So our butternut squash has been sauteing away for the last few minutes. So to this, we're going to add our onion and garlic. Our red chilli. And ground cumin. And we're just going to continue sauteing for the next couple of minutes, releasing all those delicious flavours. As you'll notice, I'm using a, a wooden spoon to mix the ingredients. You can use a wooden spoon or, or a plastic spoon. Just make sure you don't use any metal implements because they can actually affect the non-stick coating that's on the inside of the jug. Okay, that's our sauteing done. So we're just going to turn the saute function off with a button on the side of the handle here. Now we're just going to add the rest of our ingredients. So we have some ginger. Some lime juice. Some coriander. And some vegetable stock. Give that a mix. Also got some coconut milk just to go in. And that's it. That's all our ingredients to create this delicious butternut squash, chili and coconut soup. So now what we do the lid on the top of the product you can then see the lights sequencing across our different functions so with this recipe we're actually going to use the chunky function that allows you to cook soup in 28 minutes so as you see I press this mode button the different functions are selected so we go through from chunky to juice to blend so if we select chunky press the select button you can see the digital display shows 28 minutes so this will now countdown from 28 minutes through to the end of the cooking cycle you just literally leave this and get on with whatever you've got to do okay so our butternut squash has been cooking away we've got four minutes left on the cooking cycle we're just going to see how we're getting on one of the beauties of the product is that you can remove the lid during the cooking process and you can add more ingredients and you can season to taste so we just add in a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper when you put the lid back on the product the product remembers when you took the lid off and just continues its cooking cycle until the end of the cycle so our saute and soup soup maker has just beeped at us so we know it's finished its cooking process we were making our butternut, butternut chili and coconut soup you can see the end results here you can see we've still got some quite chunky bits of butternut squash in here on the um, chunky cooking process, it actually works on a heating cycle. So what we're gonna do is use our blend cycle on the top of the product just to make it a little bit less chunky because that's how I prefer my soup. So to select the blend setting, use your mode button, cycle across to the blend setting and then just press the select button. And 
let's blend in the content to the jug for as long as we want, again, to get that perfect consistency and the exact consistency that we want from our soup. Okay, so we'll have a look. It's perfect. And there we have delicious bowl of butternut squash, chili and coconut soup. So that was our sautéing soup soup maker. For further information about the product, visit www.morphyrichards.co.uk or alternatively visit us on our social media channels.